Look, he's a bigot. Mm. <laughs> With camera, there it is. Morning. Hi, so I'm going to show you my outfit for the day. So um, I'm going to go off on an adventure, so I figure I'm going to dress like an adventurer or a spy. I don't know yet. No, I do know because I've already chosen my outfit. Anyway, this is just a shirt from Primark. I wanted to wear um, like a cream colour shirt or like an ivory colour, but I don't actually have one. So maybe that's something I might look out for today. My skirt. is a herringbone tweed wool blend skirt. This is from Sainsbury's too. That's quite nice. And it's also got a matching jacket. I love this. So I maybe look like I'm going hunting at the moment. I've also got this, which looks and feels like cashmere, but it's not. It's just like polyester or viscose or something. And this is from Primark. Now, now I'm starting to look a bit like a spy, aren't I? Can you sort this collar out? Would you put the collar over the overcoat? Hmm. Okay, that's cool. I've also got some accessories. So, you may know about these gloves. I do like green. These are the infamous Vivian Westwood gloves. I love them. Now, I am all up for dressing for an adventure, even if you're going on a bus ride to the post office. I'm all about that shit. And maybe even a hat. Although it's the wrong colour green. And it's not really a spy hat, this is more a country woman hat. But anyway, that's kind of my look for today. Of course, I'm wearing Doc Martens to go with it, because, you know, yeah, I think I might lose the hat. And also, because I'm going to puff call, it's quite windy there, and it'll just fly away. 
but that's my look for today. I've got to now take off the glove to press the <laughs> stop recording button. So, excuse me one second. So I'm in Boots at the moment, I've just done my post and I'm having a look at the 50% off sale. So you may have seen a little while ago I did some retail arbitrage on these sets. Now I have sold the that size one of the Snow White one uh, for £25, I paid £12 for it. They don't have any of the smaller ones left but bizarrely the bigger ones, so these ones which would now be £22.50, are actually going for less than the smaller size ones of the Snow White. So if you have in your store any of the smaller size, that size one, so £12.50 of the Snow White one, they're selling better than the larger size of them. How bizarre. But yeah, if you've got any in yours, I don't unfortunately. If you've got any in yours, go and pick some up. You never know, might be a good seller for next year. Cheers, bye bye. Oh, it's absolutely pissing it down here in Bridgend. So I might just leg it over to that charity shop over there, which is Bernardo's, and have a quick look before I go and get on the bus and head to Puff Call. Oh, they haven't stocked up in a while, but three for a fiver and two pound each. So I'm gonna, got that already, I'm gonna see if I can find something else. So the, the, <laughs> the spy look is holding up well, as you can see. A little bit damp. Oh well. We're here at the exciting bus station in Bridgend waiting for the either the X2 or the 63, which you can't see anyway, so it doesn't really matter. And um, Bridgend smells of marijuana today, so that's delightful. Just everywhere. So much that I start to get paranoid that it was actually me. <laughs> it's not me. Beals Fish and Chip Shop, that place is awesome. However, we're not going there. We're going to cross this road, that's Plus Call by the way, and go to Emmaus. Yay! And here we have Emmaus. This is maybe my favourite Emmaus. Um, just because it, it's almost like an antique shop inside, and I quite like that. So, ooh, there's some china maybe for my sister, possibly. That's the first one of the call then, that's Mayor's then. Um, the lovely manager of, um, of the shop, she keeps all the broken jewellery for me and I just give a donation. So I think I just spent £14 in there. Oh my god, it is so bloody windy. <sighs> Jesus, right. Do I go and get a sausage from the sausage shop? No, I'm not going to. I'm going to be good. I brought lunch with me and I'm going to head off to the next show. So, the hell, I'm a bit windswept. Right, that's the two of the calls, that's where I'm going to be heading a bit. But first of all, I'm going to go down there. That's where we should be. I'm going to see a tattoo. Who knows? Hmm, it's not looking overly promising today. Oh, that's.
And I forgot to have my packed lunch, so I'm going to have my packed lunch and some coffee now. Oh and there's a big bag of jewellery and I might go live with it. I don't know. We'll see. It's somebody from a charity shop and it's Emmaus and they've already gone through to try and find the gold and silver. Fair enough. But we'll see if there is anything decent in this. I'm just going to um, close this out. Oh, why are you... F uh, sorry, I'm just updating things on eBay. More glitches. Thanks, eBay. Um... Okay, thanks. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to close out this video by going, thanks for joining me today. I'll be hosting Salad Ladies Live tomorrow, I think. Which I'm very nervous about. <laughs> Anyways, I'm sure it'll be okay. Um, so join us for that, and um, I shall be back with another vlog soon, I guess.